sketchbook tours yet please finally i'm doing a video about this so um as you can see there's a lot to unpack here and i already know there's gonna be a lot of terrible artwork here and i'm really scared of what's about to come since all of these started around i think 2016 the earliest i think it is 2016 up until the recent one which is 2024 yes 2024 i started a new sketchbook as well which is this one i'm almost halfway through ish like i'm almost halfway through as you can see um i'm not going to open this because i'm just gonna make another sketchbook tour once i'm finished with this one but we're just gonna focus on these lot yeah but anyways we'll just start on the first one okay we'll start with the first one which is this one i think this is the very very first sketchbook well in heavy quotation marks because i couldn't find my old one when i was in the philippines anymore um so we're just gonna start with this oh no <laughs> oh my god no i think yeah this is really bad this is me and my friend mm, really mm, and moving on <laughs> okay oh i already oh no 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 wait Okay, for the record, right? I think I was 11 or 12 when I was doing this. Obviously, it would be really bad. I was trying to go for realism, but as you can see, this is not realism at all. And by the way, I haven't done like anatomy lessons before this, but I mean, it's not that bad. Pretty decent. That's me, by the way. Oh my gosh. Okay, never mind. Moving on. Oh! <gasps> no! Not FNAF! No! <laughs> I left it already. Not FNAF. Oh my gosh. I know this fan art too well. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay, this hand. I remember like I was so proud of this hand. I mean, it's not that bad. The shading can be a bit fine. Also, like cursive. Yeah, I really thought it says thank, thank you. <laughs> anyway, it's moving on. Oh, wait. My little pony OC! Oh, of course, she's an alicorn. I mean, I like her design. The base is kind of accurate to the My Little Pony figure. But I feel like her head is a bit too big. I might be wrong about that. But not gonna lie, yeah, it's actually like really, really nice. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> More FNAF! More FNAF! No! Wait, did that blend? Hey, that's actually a really nice blending here, but like, I think I got lazy around here. Also, like, I think the artist for this, I think it was like Tony Cry Knight, if I remember. Like, I used to love his animations on like, YouTube, and yes. Oh, wait, is this from Google or like, Tumblr? I don't remember. Oh, okay. Rapunzel and Eugene, okay. Oh my gosh, my comment at the very bottom, wait, wait I don't think you guys can see it, but it says here like, oh no, I can't. No, okay. I, I'm just gonna do it sideways. I think it says like, lol, worst one yet, I guess. <laughs> Even like, 11 year old me knows it's really bad. I mean, I can understand why the anatomy is off, the eyes are not it, the arms and the coloring, it's so bad. Okay, more Tumblr-esque aesthetic. Ooh, chibi me, okay. I think this is from Pokemon, right? I'm sorry guys, I'm so uncultured on Pokemon, but I'm trying to improve on it, okay? I really like this. Like, these two are so cute. Okay, anime? Okay, we're getting on there, okay. Oh no, what is this? Wait, oh no. <gasps> oh my gosh, I remember, like, I drew my friend because I was like, oh, I'm trying to draw portraits. I am so sorry I gave this to her. Yeah, no. Ooh, Marceline. Ooh, okay. I think the reason why it's empty here, I was supposed to draw Marshall Lee, but I never got to because I was like, wait, I don't know how to draw men. <laughs> but anyways, is that it? Wait. No, it can't be, right? No, it, it can't be. It can't be it. Okay, no. There's absolutely no way that's it. Ah! <laughs> oh no, I saw it. I saw it. No, mango. No, not the mango in spring trap fan art please hey but i'm not gonna lie yeah the blending here got better i think i tried to like draw on top of it but i'm not gonna lie yeah the blending okay we're learning a bit of it oh 
wait. Okay, I did not draw this. I know I did not draw that. Like, I know I did not. Did I draw this or I did not draw it? I don't think I drew it because if I remember correctly, right? When I was in the Philippines, like, we used to draw in, like at the very back of notebooks. And I have this one classmate who's like really, really good at like doodle art. Like, he's really good at doodle art. And I was like, wait, can you draw me like an Adventure Time doodle art? And he drew this. And I think I'm the one who colored it. No wonder why it's so bad. Um, I think, wait, is that it? Oh, nope. We have one more. Terror and Beast Boy, of course. By the way, this is like, I think, the base of it. I used ballpoint pen here. Oh my gosh. Not bad. Like, it's really not that bad. I like it. Oh, no. There's more. There's stuff that fell out. Okay. Cat Noir, of course. A Miraculous fan. Hello. And Ladybug. I know I did not draw these because the art style is so different. My friend did it. Okay. What is this one? Eh? Oh, wait. Actually, hold on. I think I know... This is definitely copied, I already know, because this art style, I don't draw like this. Eh, not bad though for a copy, but like, mm, I mean, technically, this is how I learned to draw. It's actually not that bad. Okay, this is really nice. I really like the drawing of this. Like, I feel like it is on model and, oh my gosh, okay, pop off. Okay. Okay. Proper sketchbook one. So this is when I started like marking the sketchbooks one piece at a time. Okay, we'll start with this. Oh, so these are Descendants like stickers. I really like Descendants as a kid. Ooh, oh no. <laughs> okay, as you can see, it's like sketchbook one. An eye, a true artist would draw it. Okay, I'm just kidding guys. This is my very first OC, I think. Her name's Hikari. I actually tried to redraw her this time. So yeah, you'll see her in my Instagram more often. Okay. Ooh, not bad, not bad. I like it. Not bad for a 12 year old. Okay, next. Fairy tale. Oh my gosh, I love fairy tale. You guys don't understand how much I love fairy tale as a kid because it's like the very first anime well not technically my first anime but it's the one that i consider as my very first anyways natsu he's so cute definitely like copied though i think this is copied some eyes but more anime guild marks hey you know what these are technically on model not that bad Oh my gosh, another one. It's Lucy this time. Eh, not bad though. A flower, okay. Oh my gosh, plushy base. Yeah, I wanna make my own sting plush. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is the beginning of it. As you guys might know by now, I have this thing going on, like a comic slash animation that's technically on development. I only had the character designs for now, but the story is still like being developed along the way so these are their first designs you guys might know more in my insta but anyways not bad i know this pose is definitely from an anime i already know i think it might be soul eater actually that i got the pose from but uh, what, what what is going on with this feet bro what is this but the side view is not that bad definitely of proportion but um mm -mm. hands Oh my gosh, I used to draw hands like this. That's crazy. What? Okay, like eyes. Oh my gosh, I used to draw my eyes like this. I think it's from fairy tale though. I blame fairy tale for my very beginning of art tale because they used to draw their eyes like this, like two toned. The hands are not that bad, but like I, we're still like what? Another Evermore art. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> definitely copied. I already know this is definitely copied. This is from this is Bill Cipher, guys. Oh my god, no. Definitely did this during class. I could tell because it's from a piece of paper. What's underneath? Oh, okay. Never mind. That is really bad. More eyes. Yeah, when I'm in class and I have a lot of sticky notes with me, so I could just put it on my sketchbook. Literally, what I do is that I draw eyes, different type of eyes, and put it on my sketchbook. Next, more heads. Okay. Yeah, I tried to do anatomy as much as I can. I think that's how I got better like quickly because I used to do anatomy on almost every single part of my sketchbook. Hector from Coco. I remember I just finished watching Coco. I really want to draw Hector because like I like the skeletal studies that they did for it. Another Evermorph. I actually really like this one but definitely I use this one Soul Eater panel manga. I don't know if I can find it but if I find it, I can show it like around here. 
but yeah i know this is definitely i referenced heavily on like the pose for that one specific soul eater manga panel okay moving on oh oh this is from miraculous if you guys know what this is from miraculous you would know sting fan art wait no this is copied this is definitely copied i can already tell this is copied oh my gosh fairy tale oc girl your forehead oh my god this is Mm -mm. No, I just I can't I can't look at it. But yeah, she is so Mary Sue. I think like she is the sister of Rogue. But okay, we don't talk about this anymore. I'm embarrassed about this. Okay, more eyes and sticky notes. I think these two characters they're from Emery Chu's videos. Moving on. Wait, what's it underneath this? Oh, never mind. It's a terrible eye. Okay. My OC anatomy. I never developed the OC. Oh, keychains. Oh my gosh, I really want to make my own keychains. I remember, like, I was supposed to make, like, these specific keychain designs for my friends in high school. Yeah, these are the designs that I end up doing. Oh my god. I mean, I really like this, but it's not that bad. It's just that it's not even chibi. It doesn't look chibi enough for me. Especially with the current style I have, it's not chibi enough. I'm sorry. Ooh, it blended too much. I think I am so proud of this one before, but now looking at it, it's not that bad. It's 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 alright. Okay, yeah, I hated this page. Like, mm -mm, no, I'm not doing this again. Nope. Ooh, wings. Okay, I think this is Minerva from Fairy Tale. Oh yeah, definitely. Also, wing studies, cause um, I have that one character in Evermore that has wings. Well, not really, but okay. <laughs> More Evermore. Okay, it used to be Enchanted University, right? But it's Evermore now, so shh. No one knows that, okay? Mavis! I think from here is when I got my first set of, like, alcohol markers. Not gonna lie, yeah? It's actually not that bad, considering, like, this is not marker paper, by the way. I really hate this one. I think the yellow is just too bright. The skin, I don't have the right color for the skin. That's why I use, like, a white gel pen. You could see it. Like, you could see the streaks. Okay, one marker challenge. Of course, I did that. Okay, yeah, no, this is terrible. The colors just clash. The forehead is too big what is the fringe doing like and what are these hey urza i actually like this one i really like it that's all i can say i like it mm, observational study yeesh pearl oh my gosh this is when i started watching steven universe who this part yet yeah, ignore the stain here this happened during a school trip right like we were out for five days this stain someone spilled their drink how dare they anyways eclipsa oh my gosh i really like this you know the fact that it doesn't have any line art i feel like it actually works well oh gosh ship art i don't know i don't know who is this supposed to be but um i'm not allowed to say people's names in this channel but okay Jaden, I think I post this in my very very old art account. Here, I think I was trying to teach my friend how to draw. It didn't turn out bad. Like her drawings actually not that bad. This is the one that she drew. This is the one I drew. I should not be an art teacher. That's the end of official sketchbook one. Now we're moving on to sketchbook two. Okay, sketchbook two. Bam. It literally, oh my gosh, I made a note. I was like, finish this. <laughs> I'm already telling myself to finish my sketchbook. What a great motivation, young me. Congrats. Hikari, oh my gosh. Yeah, I mean, you could tell that the art is getting better or the same. Oh no, definitely got better. Oh yeah, no, definitely got better. Okay, improvement. Really nice. Um, <laughs> this is so bad. I have no words. It's the hand backwards, like, it's holding the candy, like, I, I, like, huh? Like this, huh? Also, I'm not bothered to draw the other arm, so I have to put it in the pocket. Also, the hair with sprinkles, I don't know why she's supposed to be, but anyway, moving on. <gasps> Blue diamond! Oh, yeah, you could tell the paper is really bad. You could see the streaks. It's really, really bad. Also, when I was little, I was really heavy-handed when I was, like, holding the pencil. That's why, like, you could see the streaks. But I got better at it when I started doing more artworks. You'll see it later on. Ooh, more. Definitely did this during class. Also, eyes for my old cast forevermore yeah a lot of eyes trying to experiment with like different eye styles but guys 
I'm better now, okay? I have a lot of variation with the eyes I do in my artworks, so that's a very big improvement. Yay! <laughs> but yeah, these hairstyles definitely fairy tale inspired. I could already tell. Ooh, under the water. <laughs> this is where I learned how to do like like perspective-ish art because I was doing art classes, right? When I was in high school, also did it for GCSE. If you guys want to check that, like my GCSE stuff art, you can just I'm gonna put it somewhere here. But anyways, um, this was pre GCSE, so before I even started doing GCSE. Ooh, okay. I did this for a friend who is my ex friend now. Long story short, a lot of stuff happened. Oh, this is the photocopy version. I gave her the original. OCs? Maybe, maybe not. Definitely Adrian addressed. Uh, addressed? What? Definitely Adrian address coded. Moving on. Soul Eater Moon. I, I can already tell that Soul Eater. Ooh, okay. This is not part of Evermore anymore, okay? Like, this non-existent in the canon universe now okay it's non-existent more doodles wow science awesome work of course i'm an overachieving student everyone knows that everyone who knows me knows that eyes Ooh. okay more eyes you guys need to hear the backstory for this joint okay so basically we made this friend named ariel right so i was like you know what let's draw him ariel and i was like you know what let's troll him a bit it was not funny, okay? It, it's really not. More doodles. Eh, not bad though. It's really not bad, but yeah, more doodles. Okay, perspective. It's not that bad, but these buildings. Girl, who- This don't look right at all. This looks right, this doesn't. What is this? Like, no. Ooh, oh my gosh. So I really wanna like, redraw this, like, digitally. Oh my gosh, more ship art. I don't know where this came from. I really don't know. Um, <gasps> Never mind. I know what this artwork is about and I'm not about to freaking no. No, moving on. Anyways. Oh, moving on. You guys already knew. I love fairy tale. Definitely inspired by one of Urza's outfits. I like it. It's it's nice. Like the sword. Oh my gosh, I know one of my friends who might watch this video, he's gonna like laugh. I already know. <laughs> I did this for a friend, okay? She made it her Wattpad banner. I know. <laughs> but the forehead. I swear to god, why do I keep making the forehead too big, okay? Why did I do that? Okay, more perspective drawing. I gave up halfway through. <laughs> you could tell, I already gave up. <gasps> the girlfriend fairy this is emmerich's character oh my gosh yeah i remember like my art style i really want my art style before to be like emmerich's one and i mean to be honest my art style now is so far from emmerich's art style but she did like impact my art style a bit so yay i really like rosa's art style like the painterly art style yes this is his character nima oh Oh my god, this is my old art account. It's non-existent now. The head is too big. The hands. What is this arm length? This- No. <laughs> I just don't like it. Nira. Okay. Yeah, another Enchanted University slash Evermore art. Another Evermore art. Definitely fairy tale inspired. If you guys watch fairy tale, you know which scene I'm talking about. Um, Soul Eater reference. Evil Mira. Mwahaha, she's not evil anymore, guys. She did not turn evil this time, okay? Maka, that doesn't look like Maka, darling. That is not Maka, anyways. I forgot their name. I think it's my Mangaka Life. I remember I was watching it because I really want to create Evermore into a manga back then. But now, like, since I'm an animation student, I can make an animation about it. Well, technically, actually, currently making this video, I've actually already, like, start doing some animatic forevermore which i'm hoping to release on youtube soon or probably before this video so yeah oh my gosh victor oh my gosh it's such a tragedy they stopped making yuri on ice adolescence like the movie they canceled it ah, i'm so sad but yeah i finished yuri on ice but yeah moving on this is actually really not that bad 
definitely heavy on like Emreach's art style. I could already see it. You could tell I'm not a Pokemon fan. Look at this. What is the Urza? Okay, this is actually really good and almost on model for Urza. But yeah, it's actually really nice. I remember I spent a lot of time making like drawing this and I really liked it. But looking back at it now, it's actually not that bad. It's just the arms. The arms is... Mm -mm. Lady Rainicorn. You could tell who's my favorite freaking female character in Fairy Tale. It's Urza. But yeah. <gasps> oh my gosh. Original design for a keychain. Oh my gosh. For Mira. This was her original design. Her design now is definitely different. So this one, I actually did this for my cousin. She asked me like, hey, can you draw me this? I'm like, I got you. I got your cuz. You could tell. I don't know how to use color pencils. But yeah. The blending here is so muddy. I don't like it. The key as well. Not that good. Yep, redrew my cousin's OC. Like, one color challenge. Not bad, but you could tell I have the same face syndrome. Like, yeah, no. Oh my gosh, pink diamond. Okay, this artwork is actually not that bad. Like, it's actually pretty good. But I could tell there's some anatomical mistakes. Also, I use, like, I think a silver gel pen. But yeah, it's actually not that bad. Oh my gosh, circus baby. I'm still in my FNAF phase. Oh no. Mm -mm, no. Uh, okay. <gasps> Ooh, sting. Okay, this part wasn't animated yet when I when I drew this, okay? This was from a manga panel, but when it got animated, right, it was so good. But I could tell that the face is wrong. And also the hand here, it was supposed to be foreshortened. And also the waist. Oh my god, that's like one piece of women waist, bro. You can't. <laughs> okay, miraculous. Of course. Marinette. Ladybug. Not that bad. Oh my gosh, I really hated this. Like, do I have a freaking sticky note? I really don't want to look at it. Hold on. I just... I just don't like how the face turned out, okay? I just... I just... I just don't like it. Okay, I really don't like the face. So that's sketchbook 2. Let's move on to sketchbook 3. Okay, sketchbook 3. Let's just get on with it. Ooh, oh my gosh, I did not draw Hikari after sketchbook 2, I think. So, okay, anyways, moving on. Okay, definitely an improvement from the second sketchbook, I can already tell. It looks nice, but the background, definitely colored pencil. Not my choice of art supply, so yeah. Peridot! Oh, this is actually cute. She slays, as usual, she does. Oh my gosh, Wendy. I remember I used to be so proud of this drawing because of the blending. This is definitely on model now. This is on model Wendy for fairy tale. I redrew my old character from my very, very first sketchbook that I completely forgot in the Philippines that I did not bring here in the UK. Her name is Comet. I finally figured out a name for her. I actually tried to redraw her every single year to see if my art style improved or not. So yeah, definitely an improvement from my very first. I'm gonna put like a photo here, like if I can find the very first drawing I've ever did of her. Hatsune Miku! Yes, Vocaloid! She's a character from Fairy Tale from the Tartarus arc. This is when I started asking people like, oh, what should I draw on my sketchbook? I got this request from like a friend in the Philippines and she plays Mobile Legends, okay? If you guys know what Mobile Legends is, okay, good for you. I don't remember from what anime this is from and I think some people in the comments might say, this is from this anime. I am so sorry. I haven't watched that much anime recently, okay? I completely forgot. But yeah. Back with my OC. Mira, she's back. I don't understand what's going on with this fit, if I'm being honest with you. And the coloring is... No. Oh yeah. I used to draw Mira in like different type of outfits and stuff like that. This is where I got my watercolors. Juvia! Oh my gosh. Okay, this is actually not bad, you know. This is really cute. I like it. Oh my god. Wait. Okay. Let me unpack here, okay? I saw this one fan art of Natsu and I was like, can I redraw that? And I did. And I'm not gonna lie, it looks good. Like, from where I'm standing right now, it actually looks good. Also, you could tell my eye drawings got better, you know? Remember from like sketchbook one? Definitely got better. White pearl. Watercolor. Yeah, sometimes it's a hit or a miss. This is a miss. I, I just don't like how this one turned out. I was supposed to do this necklace for me and my friend in the Philippines, right? I never finished this project because um, we both fell out, but it's okay. Ah! Oh my god, this is so bad. Yeah, no, 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 no. Karma. This became my PFP, like my profile picture. Oh my gosh, I've always wanted a Monokuma hoodie so bad, but yeah. Okay, I tried to do it again, like the... 
Example A, example B. Did it got worse? Did it got better? I don't know. Comment in down below, okay? <laughs> this is definitely ever after high coded. Definitely wrong anatomy again. Big forehead. Girl, why? I don't know for what OC in di or dimension is this going on, but the inking is actually not that bad. Also, I noticed a trend in my character designs. I always do this middle part because <laughs> it's natural, but like her receding hairline. <laughs> not bad. Not a bad drawing of Levi, okay? This is not a bad drawing of Levi. Definitely made his forehead too big here. I could tell it's Levi without the name. Can you tell it's Levi? We may never know. Ooh, another eclipse of drawing. Compare this to my very first sketchbook. Like, I prefer this than the recent eclipse up. But you could tell, like, an art style is starting to form. That's Jalal. You... You couldn't... T that is definitely Jalal. I know Jalal from a mile away. This is definitely from the fairy tale OVA. You could tell that the men, the eyes, they have same face syndrome. Queen B! Oh my gosh. I still watch Miraculous till this day, by the way, but I still need to caught up recently. Queen B's design, I love it so much. I don't mind Zoe's Queen Wasp, but Queen B. Queen B will always be number one. Jellyfish! Aries, fairy tale inspired for sure. I made this for a friend because she was writing stories on Wattpad and she was like, Hey, can you draw me a hover for my book? I was like, okay, what do you need? Definitely Tinkerbell inspired. Ooh, more watercolor. I like this type of watercolor artwork. Like the minimalistic type of art style. Yes, I like it. But yeah, Hermione and Star. Oh my gosh, when I said finish the sketchbook, I just did not. So that's sketchbook three. Moving on to sketchbook four. Sketchbook 4. Oh my... What's underneath? Okay, there's nothing here. Another eye. I think this is becoming a common trend now. I think we should put like a tally. My Hero OC. Definitely My Hero Academia OC inspired. The reason why I would know, it's because of the mask. That is definitely deco coded. Also, I think the eye style changed a bit. This is, I think, around when I started watching My Hero Academia. Flowers. This is actually really, really pretty. I really like it. Till this day, I still like it. This is definitely from a fan art that I just copied. I replicated my friend's drawing that she gifted to me and I was like, you know what? Let me try to do it in my art style. You could tell my art got better with the watercolor as well. Look at the difference for this. Male studies that don't look like a male. <laughs> I think this is for a DTI wise I did for Insta. This is someone else's character. I completely forgot who it is. So I'm so sorry. This is actually good. And I managed to learn how to draw hands. That is definitely an improvement. Like I started to learn how to do shadows and stuff like that. Filipino pride, raw! Freddy, Chica, and Bonnie. Okay. Definitely still on my FNAF face. Yes. You could tell I'm developing an art style around this point now. Kirishima, I made him like a twink. This is supposed to be a comic I'm supposed to do, but I never did it. I did not continue this character at all after this sketchbook. Like, I think I got bored with it. I think this was a character of my friend. Same with this. Oh, forgive me. Okay, finally, I spelled Pikachu right. What is this? Senpai? No. Todoroki eating soba. Yeah, it's the same character, by the way. Look, I was like, should I go for a more anime art style or should I just go with the Adventure Time art style? Oh, I actually like this character. But she looks too much like Sapphire from Steven Universe. So I literally tried to build up the universe here. Okay. Not bad. More wings. Hawks? Is that you? I'm just going. I don't know. I think this might be for the air jam. I might be wrong. But I didn't continue the thingy, the idea anymore. More white pearl. It's me! Oh my gosh. Yeah, I tried to make a YouTube channel way before this one, okay? So I have this specific character. You could tell it's a Jaden animation ripoff. I am so sorry, Mini Me, but that's not going to happen. We already have our own brand now, okay? You should be proud. Coming our I love Denki. Denki is one of my favorite My Hero characters. Like, he's adorable. We love him. Okay, so that's the end of sketchbook number four. Moving on to the next sketchbook. Okay, moving on to this sketchbook. Sketchbook 5. Okay, starting off strong. Oh, it's still here. Okay, so I guess I did not stop at sketchbook 4. 
Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. Definitely Steven University art style. Ooh, okay. Yeah, this is definitely a DTI wise. I'm not smart enough to have a character like this, okay? Artist research. This is an art study of Rebecca Sugar because I really do like the way that Rebecca Sugar does their like their character and stuff like that. Cause with just the shape language, it's actually really nice. Adventure time. Okay, you could tell a lot of Cartoon Network studies. I actually really like the Marceline. The Jake one, definitely on model. There's a flap. You know what that means. There's a terrible artwork underneath. I'm scared. Oh! Hey, you know what? It's not that bad. It's really not that bad, okay? It's not that bad. Looking back at it now, it doesn't look bad. Oh, no. I think this is where I'm starting to like, you know what? Let me change my art style into a more cartoony one rather than trying to go for an anime one. You could tell the paper is really bad. This isn't furry art, right? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I really like this art style. This is cute. She's adorable, okay? She's nice. But I did not develop this further. Also, the feet. Oh my gosh, what are these? Are these beans? Like, what? <gasps> okay, def this is definitely copied. I already know this is copied. Like, you could tell this is copied. There is no way that my 14-year-old brain came up with this composition. And an idea, by the way. So definitely copied. But it actually looks really, really nice. Oh, wait. I think I might remember who the YouTuber was. I remember they're also like a big fan of Fairy Tale, And they did this like artwork of Sting and Rogue. Also, I really like their art style. Like it's so blocky. I like it. But yeah, this is not my work. Definitely not. Like I definitely copied it. spider Sona. Okay, I think this is the year when Spider-Verse came out. But yeah, this this is not my spider zone anymore. I changed it. Dang, the mint and purple combo is not working out too well. So, cousins OC again. Dang, bad girly. Oh yeah, I used to do this borders as well around my characters. I was like, you know what? I just don't want them floating in a white void. Chibis! I really like the small chibi as well as the average one. Also, the expressions are cute. Like, fire is red, water is blue. If you love me, I love you too. That don't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> that just don't make sense. Another OC. But those red wings don't fool me right now, young me. I know this is inspired by Hawks, bro. From my hero. I already know. I don't know where I got this pose from. But not gonna lie, it doesn't look that bad. Oh, wait. This is for the comic. Hold on. Wow, Fire, Earth, Atlantica, Wind Nation. Wow, so original. It's like the Avatar The Last Airbender map. But yeah, very original. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, it's not. Bakugo. Not bad. But well, what's with those shoes? Are those Crocs? <laughs> okay. Oh, it's the character again. Dragon? Since when did I draw dragons? I'm just kidding. I drew dragons during my GCSE, so it's fine. I think I was trying to do a challenge with my friends every- Like a drawing challenge with my friends every single day. And we just come back to school be like, Guys, did you draw? They're like, yes. And we draw these. Definitely copied. Definitely copied. The art style, definitely copied. Ooh, this is nice. I like it. It's blue. It's fully blue. It looks cute. Also a mermaid. Victor! Okay, you're a nice. Okay, I remember this memory like it's day. I was trying to draw my friends while they're playing chess, I think? And I did not finish it because I don't like how the anatomy turned out. Also, where her neck went. It's just not there. Sketchbook number five. We're finally finished with this. Okay, sketchbook six. We're halfway through. Oh my gosh. You could tell that the spine is like breaking off. Yeah, this is terrible paper as well. I really hate it. Like, I don't continue drawing on a sketchbook if I really hate the paper. So yeah, it's a waste of money. Oh my god, Shigaraki. More hands. More roses. More flowers, actually. This is when I started to draw it every single year. Comparison between the two comets. You could tell an art style has formed, got better, but her torso got slimmer. I think there is a big change. Gray and Juvia, I think? Is it? I think it is. Also, just pen and hatching. Definitely, the head is so big. Like, that's not the correct proportion. There's no way I did that out of, like, flipping memory. There is absolutely no way I just did that. Definitely out of Pinterest, though. 
the pose is definitely copied from Pinterest, but the colors are actually not that bad. Definitely observational drawing. Definitely observational drawing. I think this is in the playground somewhere in like central London. I don't remember where. Original characters. This is actually a cute art style, you know? I drew this, right? I was trying to teach my brother, my younger brother's friend, how to draw. He was like, can you teach me how to draw? I'm like, sure. Um, as you guys can see from like the past sketchbook, I tried to teach people how to draw. It doesn't end well, okay? This is actually not that bad of an eye. I actually like this one. This is not bad. I also like the background for this. Anyways, more mermaids. Why is my obsession with mermaids? Definitely copied off Pinterest. Oh, I remember this. If you guys watch my GCSE video, you would know which piece this is. I don't remember from what anime this is. My brother asked me to draw something like with armor. By the way, I hate drawing armor. It's just too much detail. I just hated it. I did this for my friend because she loves me. Also, the fact that this portrait looks so much better and also a big improvement from my very first drawing of a BTS member. Look at the improvement, right? This was like, I think a few months before this sketchbook, but but, like the improvement is crazy oh i still drew her i like this drawing but i think it might have been copied certain elements on pinterest definitely copied though like the watercolor blended real nicely with each other another flower drawing and i think this is the new updated spider sona she is spider cat not my spider sona currently though so that's sketchbook six moving on to sketchbook seven i just don't want to look at the art on this anymore and also the paper is so bad so i decided to stop it i didn't even made it like halfway through the sketchbook yeah moving on sketchbook 7 so this one definitely an original artwork at the front i think this is around year 10 or year 11 art style definitely improved already i can already tell also i used to do this with like my colored pencils like with the streak for the hair it doesn't look good Ooh, okay, okay, not bad. Angela and Lucas. Okay, some romance, and it's called Forbidden Love. Oh, wow, <laughs> so original. Okay, not bad, not bad. I could already see an improvement with the art style. That's crazy. Her name is Alice. Her palette is actually not that bad. I actually like the color palette for her. Also, the gold, real nice. This was when me and my family went to, like, I think the portrait gallery in central london like near trafalgar square we went there the art tricks here are actually really good like the eye another eye oh my gosh how many eyes do i need these are so nice i think these are i don't remember who the artist who does this scribble type of art but it actually looks good another dragon i think oh my gosh i got better with portraiture holy crap did this on a trip did this on a trip wait actually i don't know if this was an original design or if it was copied but i remember creating Eating something like this when I was younger so yeah this one I drew it for a friend this is her because I was like is it okay if I draw you she's like yeah no no problem we have another comic called why me world Philippines raw okay never mind I did this for a friend because she was like oh you know what I'm gonna get a gaming channel for YouTube I don't know if she ever did but if she did e hello <laughs> these are the two characters for the why me world comic thingy that I never did also this is actually really cute but definitely I think this was inspired by one of my favorite Filipino teleseries for sure. Spinel. Oh, this is when the Steven Universe movie came out. Oh my gosh, I tried to do Inktober. As you can see, I gave up on the third day. Ooh, more watercolor. Blue Diamond. Not bad. Probably a copied character. This is Hermione Granger for sure. I could tell. I tried to do this the friend saga drawings and stuff like that. And I tried to draw it, but it's so hard trying to draw them like as close to my art style as possible, but also like trying to see if that's them or not. Another creepy pasta. OC. How many creepy pasta OCs do I need? Like, I'm being serious. How many do I need? But also, this is when I got these skin tone markers. I don't understand how I used to do like artworks like these with markers. Now I can't do it. I think I redraw one of my old art, but it's really bad. Ooh, Harry Potter ones. Ooh, love this shit. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I like the design though. It's cute. Also, these two characters definitely like. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. Also, just watch Has Been Hotel around this time. That is technically on model. Another eye. Deku. I forgot whose artwork is this. I remember I followed them in Insta. I'm not proud of it. 
Oh my gosh! Tinkerbell! Well, this is actually really nice. Definitely not my art style though. Meet the artist. When was this? You could sell an art style forming now? Dang, I was 14. Lives of coffee. Still do. Okay, I think this is where I got TikTok. Oh yeah, no, I got this type of art style as well. As you can see, I kept like going back and forth with different art styles. I like this washi tape though. This washi tape is really nice. What the heck? I think this is amethyst and I think this might be Sailor Moon. What's with the buns looking like that? Friend Saga part 1, I think. Part 1 or part 2, I don't remember. Yeah, I used to do this friend saga almost every single time now, but I stopped doing it. Yeah, these are all my friends from like high school. I'm close to some of them, but now like we just don't talk that much. Friend saga part 2. Yeah, I think I kept with this type of art style with like long legs. I tried to redesign Mira for Evermore for this art style. It doesn't work. It really doesn't. It doesn't match the vibe. Oh yeah, definitely did this for TikTok. I already know. This is for my very, very first TikTok account that I deleted because I was like, you know what? I'm gonna stop having TikTok. And then I got back into it around after COVID. Oh yeah, that was my persona in TikTok before. Then I changed it. What's with the I'm floating? What? Okay. But not gonna lie, yeah. The Kageyama. Oh my gosh, this is the Haikyuu beginning. Oh no, I could... Okay, Todoroki and Bakugo doesn't look that bad. Kageyama looks alright as well. Oh yeah, I really do miss doing my markers like these. This actually looked good. The new OC challenge. Yep. Never created her again. Yep, this is the one where I started doing like the drawing all of class 1A every single day challenge. But not gonna lie, yeah, these actually look good. What the heck? They slay. Also, I think it's because of the white pen. Yeah, that's sketchbook number 7. Yeah, moving on. Okay, sketchbook number 8. I think this is 8.1 because I have another sketchbook 8. So definitely probably hated the paper for this. As you can see, it's a sketchbook 8.1. This is definitely copied from I don't know who. I am so sorry. So on TikTok, in the TikTok area. Oh, I am here. Okay, some All Might and Night Eye. Oh my god, I made Night Eye like a turtle and All Might on top of it. <laughs> More Oikawa. Yeah, Oikawa was used to be well technically i still like oikawa till this day for like haikyuu these are my two favorite characters it's kuro and oikawa it, i love them so much corona v i like this art style so much i like this oh my gosh junko still back with that art style with the just circles and then just like straight but yeah i really like this design oh my gosh wait this lace also this snaps shigaraki also someone did this trend of like if you just draw scribbles you create like the base shape you want and then you can just like draw on top of it girl your neck your neck is breaking <laughs> oh my god i don't understand how you could do her neck like that but yeah the water it's all right i got bored there was no internet and i was like you know what let me draw something i drew mickey mouth and i drew a snake this Okay, six musical, right? Catherine Aragon, Anne Boleyn, and Jane Seymour. And then... Oh, I only did three. Powerpuff Girls. Oh my god, that's some creepy Spongebob. Medusa. Definitely copied off Pinterest though. And this one. I don't know. I think this is also copied. But this is actually real nice. And I think that's it from the sketchbook. Yep, this is from the sketchbook. Let's move on to the second sketchbook for the 8.2. Okay, this is 8.2. So as you can see, this is like the official sketchbook 8. I would know because this is one of the most filled sketchbooks I've had. I think I fully filled this one. So it just says here, welcome to sketchbook 8.2. Goals, finish sketchbook, practice drawing anatomy, landscapes. Experiment different styles. At least draw every day. Good luck. I literally say good luck. Also, you can tell the art style definitely improved. Dang. Okay, starting off strong. Sasha. Some My Hero fan art. Oh, I actually really like the Hawks one. I like how the Hawks one turned out. Also, Mirko. Two of my favorite pro heroes in My Hero. I drew heads and male anatomy. Also, this is actually real good. Oh, no. Not another rebrand. I was like, I'm gonna stop doing Evermore because I'm like, I don't see a future with it before. Like, Enchanted University. I stopped it. And I was like, you know what? No. Ochako. And this is Joseph. What's with the anatomy here? It's not anatomy. Definitely inspired from that one scene from 
from Teen Titans. Same with this one. Really colorful spread. Mira again. Another Mira. You're not Spider-Man. I was about to make these keychains for my friends for the very end of like year 11. I was supposed to make them, but I didn't because I was like, you know what? I'm not close to the majority of them, so no. Ooh, more Mira. Her name is Sophia. She is Mira's partner in crime in the new series. Well, I did not continue that anymore. Justin Bieber as Naruto character. Huh? That don't look like Justin Bieber. Or does it? I don't know. His name is Samuel. Polar bear. If you guys know the trend back on Instagram, it was the try to redraw that Sailor Moon screenshot. And I did this. But I redrew it again, like, I think two years ago. And definitely it was a big improvement in the art style. This is the new comic that I did to include Mira, right? It's freaking called Target. I don't know what I did. It's freaking Target. It was so bad. These are the main characters, right? We have Mira, we have Samuel, and we have Joseph. Definitely copied, copied. That's from Haikyuu. That's Marceline. Another eye. Oh my gosh. On almost every single page, there's an eye I see. Yeah, Candace Flynn from Phineas and Verb. I think this is a friend of mine. Noses. Raven. More studies. That's me. Oh my gosh. He's looking like Lloyd from Spy Family. Is it just me? Oh my gosh, that's so Lloyd coded. We have some stuff down packet. Okay, this is Comet. Oh, this was for my birthday back then. Oh, I think this is for an Aikatsu cover that me and my friend did, but I never released it. Sorry, girl. Um, I got busy. Yasuga's birthday is on the 13th of June, which is literally after my birthday, which is crazy. This one was a commission drawing for my friend. I sent him the photo of it, and yeah. As you guys can see, right? You could see some of the similarities around the time that I was doing this sketchbook. Also, with my GCSE art sketchbook tour because I also did the same thing but this actually looks good if you squint your eyes also this was Mira's redesign you could tell I told you it's called Target look at that also the silhouette being just overall triangle is actually not that bad Joseph redesigned Target okay this design looks so much better okay yay okay so this is where I got my name now Millie Vanny Burbs so it's adorable I like this one and Jiro and also some fish definitely inspired by Tiffany Wang you know what this outfit reminds me of? the freaking one slur like no also Starfire this is amazing this I really like the coloring for this like ballpoint pen and then just putting like thing on it backgrounds okay I didn't bother unlining this you could already tell this is really bad <laughs> but the anatomy is not that bad though I redrew it but I hate the why did I do the background like that? That's so bad. Oikawa. Kuro. Literally, I have this outfit. I could recreate this outfit if I want to. Oh yeah, these are my first time getting gouache. And I have no idea what to do with it. This is for my GCSE one. If you've seen it, you'll know which one I'm talking about for this. Perspective. And that's it. Oh my gosh, I actually finished the sketchbook. That is crazy. That is sketchbook number 8. Moving on to sketchbook 9. Okay, sketchbook 9. We only have two more and we're finished. Started October 5th, 2020. At least now I started to date my freaking sketchbooks because before I did not, which is really, really sad. Raven and Beast Boy. Did I just make them too buff? Anyways, goals. Study from real life. Practice more anatomy. Study color theory. Study slash practice every day and try more media. Figure drawings. Okay, definitely copied off Pinterest though. Color pencils. I like how this one turned out because it was supposed to be this but I did this but like I only have colored pencils so what am I supposed to do? This mushroom looks nice. More observa- no, not observational, sorry. More figure drawings. Definitely used gouache. This one, I'm really happy with this. This looks nice. Like this one really looks good. I like it. Okay, more figure drawings. I think like I just tried to do figure drawings every day. Did this on a graph paper. Okay. Jimin Sayer OC. Eh, not bad. Also, I used to do this. I don't know why. Who did I got this idea from? Like doing highlights like that? Also, that looks cute. I like that. I would wear that. Oh no, did I rebranded freaking Mira again? Oh, it's this trend. I remember when this trend happened in, I think, Instagram? There's these two characters. I don't know from what series they're from, but one is wearing like a jester hat like thingy and this character wearing this this actually looks good what the heck the hair looks the hair is herring i really wish i could do marker art like this again but i can't i don't know how because i don't draw with markers anymore which is so sad like oh, it's such a downgrade because i stopped using markers when i start got into like digital art which is really really sad also i tried to practice with my left hand here another eye drawing escanor oh my gosh seven deadly sins this is not a bad drawing you know but the arm oh I draw something upside down. 
I drew it upside down. What the heck? Oh, this is for my friend. Yeah, he asked me to like, oh, create me a demon slayer. So now I'm like, I got you, bro. And the funny thing is that he's an art student, but he doesn't draw anime art style. And I'm like, okay. Oh my gosh, I don't like how this one turned out. Oh, this is actually not bad. Gymnastics? Hikari. Oh my gosh, Hikari finally came back after like what being gone for how many sketchbooks already. <laughs> I did this one too. I was doing this drawing, I think, on my second vlog in this channel. So yes. Color compositions. Ooh, Shinobu. Definitely off model. But her thingy is on model is just the face that I'm kinda a bit off about. Ooh, Shigi. Oh, I like the red. Real nice. This is a redrawing of I think one of the first drawings I've ever did. Like on sketchbook one. Hold on. Let me find it. Let me find it. Definitely a redraw of it. Definitely improved. You could see the improvement on the sketchbooks. Like the arm looks good the skirt more flow the cape is flowing it's following the the side form of it definitely an improvement from the very first sketchbook considering this is already sketchbook like sketchbook 9 oh yeah i tried to make like a freaking profile picture for my instagram i really like this one though i wish i did this xiao okay this is when i also started playing genshin this is actually not a bad xiao drawing oh my gosh that's a lot of math at the very back of my sketchbook that's it for sketchbook number nine okay sketchbook 10 we're almost near the end i think this is after jesus you know so sketchbook goals study perspective figures landscapes okay color theory fill the sketchbook study anatomy especially hands do real life drawings do backgrounds started at 16th of april 2021 so this is definitely like before i finished gcse like around near end of gcse not a bad watercolor drawing actually i really like this xiao of course Ooh, d look wait you know what that looks good you know i really wish i could do markers like this again i might do it for my sketchbook recently but i haven't literally done any marker work around sketchbook 11 for sure you you guys will see cat noir hey that's actually a good cat noir drawing you know grapes but it looks fake <laughs> But it looks nice. Like, what? Okay, anatomy. Meet the artist. Oh, I think I should do that this year. Because I'm a freaking animator. I could do that. Junko Enoshima. I think I also did this for a vlog. Hands! Birthday post. 16th. Wait. Oh, no. This was in my old art account. Highlight. Oh, yeah. This is definitely on my old art account. This is also where I got my very, very first drawing tablet, I think. Ooh, that's me. YouTube colors. Mint, purple, and gray. Never happened because the YouTube colors now is blue and purple. So, yippee. <laughs> Painting ideas for mom. Never did it. Drawing animation. I changed it. <laughs> I changed it. Ooh, this is nice. What the heck? Did I glue it? Oh, I glued it. Ooh, Rengoku. Hey, that's actually good, Rengoku. I like it. Yeah, this is definitely in my old art account. I wanna do this again, actually. But I don't know which characters I'm gonna do. Oh, wait. Hey, not bad. Definitely from Pinterest. I could already tell that's from Pinterest. Also, I just put this like piece of, I think it's parchment paper or tracing paper I put because I don't want the graphite to just smudge over this. Also, RM from BTS. Also, this is actually more stylized. Definitely copied on Pinterest though, for sure. Again, Pinterest be saving my sketchbooks. His name is Lucas. These are cute though. Like, what the heck? Male figure. Tried to do more males. Hey, my male figure anatomy got better, you know. And Renee. Ooh, more figures. Kim Jisoo. Okay, this is jisoo more anatomy banana perspectives why do i make my old art like my sketchbook so nicely and now it's just blah Ooh, art style bend no line art blues purples highlights glow no girls no girls <laughs> sketches for drawing i think this is the child drawing but these are definitely from like my school's notebook and stuff like that and i just stuck it my sketchbook amogus <laughs> Ooh, more Sailor Moon. I actually do like the art style for Sailor Moon. Like, this one is adorable. This one is also cute. Wait, these are nice. What the heck? This is nice. I think this is Jenny. Todoroki. Eh? That looks good. What the heck? Colored pencil as well. That's for my brothers and stuff, I think. Ooh, nice artworks. Not that bad. You could tell that I messed up the face here. There's a bit of flap here, so that means, like, I messed up real bad. But... 
yeah. Okay, this is when I started college. Also, I really like their design, but I feel like her legs are too long. And her head is too small, I think. Hey, this is cute. What the heck? Oh, I was supposed to finish this Lisa drawing. I never did. <gasps> Loki from Fairy Tale. Yes. We're back in my fairy tale grind. Very good. Class doodles as well. Oh my gosh, I did this drink class in freaking B Tech art. Oh my gosh. Chuya from Bungo Stray Dogs, because yes, I like his design. This is my cousin's OC. Drew it again. Wait, actually, let me compare the very first time I drew her character. If I can find it. Because I have so many sketchbooks. Like, look at that. Oh my gosh. Definitely an improvement because the eye shape is like different. And the hair, it makes sense. And the hands, yes! Finally, literally good improvement as well. That's not too. Also, I don't draw hair like this anymore. Guys, if you know who this character is, I'm so sorry. I found it on Pinterest and I was like, you know what? Let me try drawing men. Bakugo fan art and Kaya from Genshin. I think I messed up his proportions though. That's from my old sketchbook as well. Okay, this is Katsumi. Okay, if you guys know Jinja Ninja, they have this series that they're trying to produce called Prism. And bro, they inspired me so much to create my own series. So yes. Also, Haikyuu TikTok. Oh no! <laughs> Oh, this is when I tried to draw Haikyuu characters bit by bit. So, I was like, Hinata being an orange, Kageyama, milk, Yamaguchi, french fries. Hey, you know what? These are really nice drawings of Haikyuu boys, you know? Almost the same as, like, people. Like, Kageyama's one looked a bit like Kageyama. Hinata, Hinata. Oh my god! Ah! Suga! Oh my gosh. I actually like the Suga and Daichi one. Suga, sugar, Daichi, the meat buns, and then... Noya popsicle stick. Hey, that's actually so smart. <laughs> these are so good. Like, why did I stop doing these? YT video illustration gifs. Oh, this is supposed to be for the GCSE art video. Ooh, armor. Oh gosh, I am so bad at drawing armor, as you guys can see. Demon Slayer. There's a lot of notes. Oh my gosh. Doma. I don't... I mean, it's not... Does it look like him? I feel like it doesn't. Okay, now we're finally moving on to Sketchbook 11, which is the very, very last sketchbook that I recently finished. So, let's move on with that. And last, the very lasty last, which is the most recent sketchbook and also the longest sketchbook that took me to finish is this monstrosity of a sketchbook. As you guys can see, look at the freaking date, right? I started this around August 2022, right? And I finished this sketchbook around March 2024. This took me two years to fill up. Like, I have no words. Let's start with this sketchbook. Sketchbook 11. I started this sketchbook 2022, right? That was like midway through my first year of college. And I finished this after I flip in like finished first year of university. That is insane. You guys might have seen this in my portfolio video, so I'm not gonna put too much effort on like discussing about this. But yeah, this is also in my portfolio video. Also this one. Very nice. It looks good. Definitely more anatomy. Mira, this is the official redesign for Evermore now. I decided to bring back Evermore because I was like, you know what? It's been a passion project. Let me just do it. Another eye. I don't know who this character is. This is a painting. A lot of people like this painting, but for me, it's not bad. From far away, it looks good. Up close, it's not. It's literally acrylic. And I like the texture of it. If you guys can feel, like, if you actually feel the sketchbook like this page, you could feel like there's bumps of acrylic paint. This is also in my portfolio video. Also in my portfolio video, character design. Also in my portfolio video, me. Oh my gosh. Actually, no, that's a skeleton me. This is me. Wow, oil pastels. Okay, backstory for this. I was supposed to do Ghetto Tober, okay? Ghetto Tober. Trying to draw Ghetto every single day during the month of October with the themes, like for example, day one, gargoyle. Ghetto Tober, day two, scurry. And also Chibi Ghetto. Oh my god, it's a Gojo cat. Well, with the stitches, it's technically Kenjaku, but guys, it's like during the month of October, like spooky season, you know? So obviously, I have to draw like with the scar. So let's just say, let's just pretend it's makeup, guys, okay? Let's just pretend Kenjaku never existed. I drew this while walking by the way because we were going to one of the museums that's like actually not a museum like we were walking towards like a gallery near my college day three bat oh my gosh of course i have to draw vampire ghetto because yes also i think this is how i got better at drawing ghetto guys like he oh my gosh he looks pretty yes what a spread hang in because demon slayer yes do flamingo okay this is when i started watching one piece i think this was around 2023 a lot happened tanjiro oh my god that's freaking 
<laughs> Good job. My friend taught me how to draw Dofla, like a goofy version of Doflamingo. It's literally like this. It's so funny. A lot of Gojo. What the heck? Sanji, Choso. Oh, that's me. Ooh, One Piece spread. You could tell I actually started to like One Piece. Also, by the way, I just like, my friend was watching like Impel Down and I saw Buggy like with a ponytail. I was like, you know what? Let me draw him. Also, Law. Yes. I think I posted this on my Insta. If you guys want to check that out, you guys can see in the description. Oh, this is my school. Hehe. <laughs> this is the... Actually, no, not my school. Well, technically, it's like my building. Um, Luz from the Owl House. Because I actually like the Owl House. It's one of, like, my favorite current series. Okay, Ace. Funny thing, I actually did like Ace. I think around this period of time, I was actually watching Alabasta and then Ace appeared. So, yeah, one of my favorite spreads. I like it. Okay, my spider sona. Oh my gosh. This is my actual current spider sona. Also, I think this was also the time when um, Spider Verse 2 came out. Her name is Morpho Web. Dresses? Not bad. Okay, this character. So, I was trying to create a comic now. Well, technically, I have two series in production. One is a comic and one is an animation. The animation one is Evermore. The comic one is like a slice of life type of webcomic called Reminiscent Letters. And guess what? There is eight characters in it. But they're all simplistic designs, so I can manage it. His name is... Wait, <laughs> I forgot his name. Anyways, I still haven't like figured out their names for it. But yeah, it's I'm trying to figure out their character designs, which I'm hopefully I can post on Instagram soon. TikTok idea. Yeah, you guys can see this on my TikTok. Ooh, bunny. I found these like index cards, I think they're called, in my stash. And I was like, you know what? Since I'm not using this for GCSE anymore, let me just use it for my sketchbook and draw on top of it. Oh my god, the Fiona and Cake series. The Simon Petrikov. Also, the Ice Prince. Bro, they know what they're doing. <laughs> Ooh, food. Definitely, like some of these are like copied off Pinterest. These ones I definitely drew. Also, I just got these like gel pens that my mom bought for me. Thank you, Ma. VTubers. Matara. Khan, K9 Kuro. He's actually one of my favorite VTubers anyway, so yes. And Shu Yamino. I like Shu's second outfit. It's so nice. Ooh, okay, gel pens. The gel pens doesn't work that good in this sketch. Actually, no, it works good in the sketchbook. I think it's just the paper because it just like sips in, so it's not two minute figure sketches. Yeah, so basically, I used this app and I was like, you know what, let me try to draw figure sketches for two minutes. And for two minutes, not bad. I wish I could do it in a minute though. Luocha, my friend from uni recommended me to draw him and I was like, you know what, let me try. And by the way, I haven't started like playing Honkai Star Rail around this point. So I'm like, who the heck is Luocha? <laughs> Gojo and Ghetto, of course. It's a goober. It's me as a goober. Digi amazing digital circus. Yeah, of course, I have to draw Homni and Jax because, yes, also Ragatha. Yes. Oh my gosh, the blue period fan art. I like his character design. Oh, this is my uni volleyball. Yeah, they're amazing. Also, this is definitely Haikyuu coded. You could tell it's Haikyuu. Oh my gosh. Oh no, this is the start of a blind box addiction, which is Sanrio, by the way. Cinemoral, because Cinemoral normal is my favorite character like Sanrio character. Piplop and Doraemon. Oh my gosh, the sketchbook is breaking. Why is Doraemon look like that? Literally in my face be like. Also this is actually really cute but this is definitely from Pinterest. My man! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, technically, I like Kuro, so yes, do not look. Yeah, I stuck it in so no one can see the very bottom of that. Time skip Kuro, by the way. Oh my gosh, I am so happy that the time skip arc is gonna get animated, so eee, yippee! But yeah, I drew him so nicely though. What the heck? Green! That's a lot of post-its, but it actually looks nice. I don't know what I was supposed to put here. Oh, these are all my followers. Yeah, I tried drawing them. I like how it turned out though. Oh my gosh, that's Itadori. And that star from Wish. Cinnamoral. Buff Cinnamoral, because why not? I will kick your knees inward. What the heck? I got this because my brother won me that Squirtle plushie from Winter Wonderland and I'm so happy he got it for me because yes, fortune cookies. This is the fortune. Wait for the right moment. What does it mean, wait for the right moment? Literally. <laughs> this is me though. This is my fit. Literally, I have the same. I have this outfit. That's crazy. This actually looks good though. I like this. This is when the actual has been hotel series started. Like the one that's on Amazon Prime. Also, I really like box in the series. Also, I bought another blind box. What is that supposed to be? What are you? Wait, what? I don't know what that is supposed to be, but okay. Fia. <gasps> oh my gosh, I love how this one turned out. Oh my gosh, because, okay, her name's Reina. Like, literally, guys, this is like an OC, guys. Obviously, um, self-insert. 
<laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. I really like how this art turned out, though. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is reminiscent letters thingy. Oh, his name is Kyle. Oh my gosh. Wait. Oh wait, no. Kyle is the. Yeah, never mind. His name is Joshua. I'm so sorry, guys. I don't know my Aussie's names. No, but to be fair, they're all new, so it's fine. Angela and Joshua. Oh my gosh, I tried to do this. Like cats can form any type of shape. I think I did not do it correctly, but um, this is actually fun. This is from Magical Doremi. Technically, Magical Doremi is my very very first anime that I've ever watched. Hey, this is actually really good though. Like what the heck? Like creating a character out of like squiggles. It's so like it's really good. Eclipsa. Oh my gosh. Literally, I think this is the best Eclipsa drawing I've ever done. Like this is really nice. Also left another page blank because I was like, I don't know what to draw. Spider-Verse. Ooh. Oh my gosh. I have to draw the spot. My friend loves the spot so much and I decided to draw him. Yeah. I love this spread. This one, this is one of my favorite. It's giving comic booky vibes. Yeah, more studies with outfits this time. The reason why I did this, right? I did this because of a project in uni. Because we were like told to create an animation called End of the World. And I did. So, and it's more about robots and stuff like that. AI. So I was like, you know what? I have to draw Mecha. No matter how much I hate drawing Mecha. Also, I drew a dragon. More figures. You know I'm getting bored if I can't draw anything other than figures. Ooh, penguin! And also math equations even though I'm already in university and not doing math. For one of my characters, right, I really, really hated her design. Like, this was her old design, right, for her uniform. And then I was like, what should I do? My stupid freaking brain, right? I remember I made the design for her and I forgot where I put the design. I wish- Oh my gosh, I have to go back and redo the freaking design now again but it's okay at least i have the base more perspective drawings these are like from pinterest right but this one i replaced it with my own character akahasa i mean these are nice compositions though they're good for inspos but not for my own thingy beetles oh my gosh i like this page also the fact that it's also with blue pen real nice Pokemon! Me as a Pokemon trainer. I will do an official art for this though. And... Yup. This is the end of the freaking sketchbook. L literally, look at the notes. Like, managed to do anatomical studies. Did animal studies. Tried to do more drawings each day. Took one year and eight months to finish. That is almost two years. What in the world? But... Yeah, I decided to draw myself at the very end because I was like, I'm tired. I'm I'm gonna give up. I really just want to start a new sketchbook at this point. That's the end of like sketchbook 11. So that's the very end of the sketchbook tour. So we're finally finished with the sketchbook tour. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry that you guys have to sit through such a long video, but those are, by the way, the sketchbooks that are just pure personal work that doesn't include my school sketchbooks that I've done. Hence why, like, the very last sketchbook, like, this specific sketchbook took me so long to finish. It's because during my BTEC art, literally, I don't have enough time for personal art-wise. But anyways, since, like, being out, like, of university for a while, like, I finally started doing another sketchbook and yes this is like sketchbook 12 i got this sketchbook from uca actually from one of the universities that i applied to that i got in but yeah it's just a bit far from where i live so but yeah this is like sketchbook 12 like literally like almost done like there's a lot of it here now so yeah i only have like this much left to finish anyways thank you guys for watching this really really long sketchbook tour and i really hope that i'll see you guys on my following videos whether it be vlogs or another sketchbook tour or probably another art vlog yeah bye bye